starting with the name of Allah Almighty, who is the master of the day of judgment, and a bundle of the Rudra Islam and beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam. Dear students, Mathematics, Exercise number 4C for New Slippers Mathematics, Book 2, Class 7 of Shark Students, and Exercise 11C for New Slippers Mathematics, D1 for A level O level students. And question number 1 of this exercise is find the sum of the interior angles of each of the following polygons and A part is 11 gone. So students, there is a polygon who has 11 sides and we have to find the sum of the interior angles. And keep in mind that there is a formula sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 into 2 right angles or 180 degree. So students, here are 11 sided polygon. So in place of n we will put 11 and then 2 will be subtracted from 11 and then the answer will be multiplied with 180 and that will be the sum of the interior angles of 11 sided polygon. So students it is written as 11 minus 2 into 180 degree and we can write 2 right angle here as well as 2 right angle means 180 degree. Now students when we subtract 2 from 11 here will be 9 multiply by 180 degree and now 11, uh, 9 will be multiplied with 180. 9 multiply by 0 means 0. 9 8s are 72 and 7 is carry. And 9 1s are 9 and 7 16. So the sum of interior angles in 11 gone is 1620. Now I am going to solve B part of the same question. And B part is... 12 gone, B part means 12 gone and students again we will put the same form, we will write the same formula, sum of interior angles, sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to N, N mean number of sides minus 2 into 2 right angles are students 180 degree and n mean there are 12 sides so it is written as 12 minus 2 multiply by 180 degree and 12 minus 2 mean 10 multiply by 180 degree and when 10 will be multiplied with 180 degree it will become 1100 degree so sum of angles in 12 gone or 12 sided polygon is 1800. Now students, C part of the same question is 15 gone. 15 gone. Again, we will use the same formula sum of angles, sum of interior angles, sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree and n mean here we will write 15 minus 2 multiply by 180 degree and 15 minus 2 mean 13 multiply by 180 degree and now students 180 will be multiplied with 13 180 multiply by 13 3 zeros are 0, 3 8s are 24 and 2 carry, 3 1s are 3 and 2 5 put cross before, uh, below the unit digits and then 10th digit will be multiplied with the, all the number, all the integers so 1 zeros are 0, 1 8s are 8 and 1 1s are 1, now we will add up 0, 4, 8 plus 5 mean 13 and 2 so it is 2340 degree. So students it is the sum of 
the interior angles are 15 sided polygon and it is 2340. Now the last part of question number one is D part 20 gone. It means that there are 20 sided polygon and we have to find the sum of interior angles. So students, sum of interior angles sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree and students we will write 20 minus 2 into 180 degree and when 2 is subtracted for, from 20 we will have 18 multiplied by 180 degree so students if you have calculator you can multiply 180 with 18 and if you don't have calculator then does not matter write 180 multiply by 18 8 zeros are 0 8 8 are 64 and 6 carry 8 1 are 8 and 6 14 then put the cross below the unit digit and then multiply 10th digit with all the digits 1 zeros are 0 1 8s are 8 and 1 1s are 1. So 0, 4, 2 and 3. So the sum of interior angles in 20 sided polygon is 3240 degree. And it is question number 1 of exercise 4C. And now I am going to solve second question of the same exercise. And second question is students, there are some polygons and we have to find the values of unknown. Question number two, A part. And first I will read the question. <clears throat> find the value of unknown in each of the following figures. So students, A part is, there is a quadrilateral A, B, C, D in this way. And different angles are given. A, B, C, D and students angle A is of 78 degree angle B is 62 degree angle C is A degree and we have to find the value of A and angle D is 110 degree now students first of all you have to count the sides of this figure it is quadrilateral, I mean to say that there are four sides in this figure. So sum of interior angles in four sided polygon is n minus 2 into two right angles. So we will write sum of interior angles, sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree. So students, how many angles are there? 78, 62, 8 and 110. It means that there are 4 sides. So in place of n we will write uh, 4. And on the left side sum of interior angles. We will write all the interior angles and put the uh, positive sign plus sign. So it will be 78 plus 62 degree plus a degree that we have to find plus 110 degree is equal to n mean there are four sides so it is written 4 minus 2 multiply by 180 degree now students we will sum up these three angles 8 plus 2 mean 10 10 plus 0 mean 10 so students 1 is carry 7 plus 1 carry 8 8 plus 6 14 14 and 1, 15, 5 and 1 carry 1 and 1, 2 plus a degree that is equal to 2 multiply by 180 degree. So students 180 multiply by 2 mean 360 degree and 250 degree is plus on left side. When we transfer it to other side it will become minus 250 degree and here is a when we subtracted 250 from uh, 360 degree, 
it will be 110 degree and degree will be cancelled with degree and the value of phi a is 110. So students, the value of unknown a is 110. Now I am going to solve B part of the same question and again in B part there is a quadrilateral. Quadrilateral mean a closed figure having four sides. So students in B part again there is a quadrilateral in this way and four angles are given that are A B C D and angle A is B degree angle B is 78 degree whereas the value of angle C is 2B degree and the value of angle D is 84 degree and we have to find the value of B so students again we will apply the same formula sum of interior uh, sum of interior angles in any in any polygon is equal to n minus 2 multiplied by 180 degrees so we will apply the same formula sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree Students, sum of interior angles mean that we have to sum up all the four angles and the angles are B degree plus 78 degree plus 2B degree plus 84 degree is equal to 4 minus 2 into 180 degree. And students, B and 2B, these two figures are like terms or like figures. So we will sum up these two figures. B plus 2B means 3B degree and 78 and 84 will be added. 8 plus 4 means 12 and 1 carry. 8 plus 7, 15 and 1 carry 16 and it will be 162 is equal to 2 multiplied by 180 degree and when 2 is multiplied with 180 degree it will become 360 degree. And 162 degrees plus on left side when we transfer it to other side it will become minus and left over will be 3b degree is equal to 360 degree minus 162 degree. 2 will be subtracted from 10 and 8 from 15 we will subtract 6 and there will be 9 and uh, from 2 we will subtract 1 and there will be 1 so 3b degree is 198 degree. And students, 3 is multiplying with, with B when we transfer it to other side, it will divide. So the value of B degree will be 198 degree over 3. 3 1 are 3, 3 6 are 18, 1 carry and again 3 6 are 18. So B degree is equal to 66 degree and degree will be cancelled with degree and the value of B is 66. And it is unknown in this quadrilateral. Now I am going to solve C part and in C part there is a pentagon. Pentagon means that a closed figure having five sides. So students in C part we have to draw a figure that has five sides in this way. One, two, three, four, and then 5. So students names are A, B, C, D and E. And the value of angle A is C degree. Whereas the value of angle B is 152 degree. Whereas angle C is 38 degree. Angle D is 2C degree and angle E is 101 degree. Now students, again we will apply the same formula and the formula is sum of angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 multiplied by 180 degree and in this figure there are 5 sides 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So it is written sum of interior angles sum of interior angles in polygon 
is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree and students some mean we have to sum up all the five angles c degree plus 152 degree plus 38 degree plus 2 c degree plus 101 degree that is equal to 5 minus 2 here students in place of n we will write 5 because there are 5 sides into 180 degree and students we will sum up the right terms on left side c plus 2 c mean 3 c degree and students 152 38 and 101 will be added 2 plus 8 mean 10 10 plus 1 mean 11 and we will write 1 and 1 carry 1 plus 0 mean 1 plus 3 4 plus 5 9 and students 1 plus 1 mean 2 so it is 291 degree is equal to 3 multiplied by 180 degree now students we will sum up 3 multiplied by 180 and we will have 3 c degree plus 291 degree is equal to 3 zeros are 0 3 8s are 24 2 carry 3 1s are 3 and 2 5 and it is 540 degree 291 is plus on left side when we transfer it to other side it will become minus and left over will be 3 c degree is equal to 540 degree minus 291 degree 1 will be subtracted from 10 because we will take 1 carry from here and it is 10. 1 subtracted from 10 and here will be 9. And here is 3 and 9 cannot be subtracted from 3. So we will take 1 carry from 5 and it is 13. 13 minus 9 mean 4. And students we have taken 1 carry from 5 and here is 4. We will subtract 2 from 4 and that is 2. So it is 249 degree is equal to 3c degree and 3 is multiplying with c when we transfer it to other side it will divide and c degree will be 249 degree over 3 3 1 are 3 3 8 are 24 and 3 3 are 9 so c degree is equal to 83 degree and degree will be cancelled with degree and the value of c is 83 and c is unknown in this pentagon now students I am going to solve the last part of the same question. I mean to say part D and D part is there is hexagon. Hexagon means a closed figure having six sides. So it is in this way E, D, C, B, A, F and E. So students A, B, C, D, E and F it is hexagon and the value of A is 102 degree value of B is 5D degree C is 4D degree D is again 4D degree and students E is 108 degree and F is again 4D degree. Now students we will apply the same formula as we have applied in previous question, previous parts. Sum of interior angles, sum of interior angles in polygon is equal to n minus 2 multiplied by 180 degree so students here in this part there are six sides 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 and we will sum up all these six angles keep in mind students uh, how many sides are there in a polygon same number of angles will be there in that polygon so students we will sum up all these six angles so it is 102 degree plus 5d degree plus 4d degree plus 4d degree plus 108 degree plus 4d degree is equal to 
in place of n we will write 6 minus 2 multiply by 180 degree now students 102 and 108 both are light arms so when we sum up 102 and 108 it will be 210 degree plus 5d plus 4d mean 90 90 plus 4d mean 13d and 13 plus 4d mean 17d degree is equal to 2 minus uh, so will, 2 will be subtracted from 4 and here will be 4 uh, 2 will be subtracted from 6 and remaining is 4 multiply by 180 degree and when we multiply 180 with 4 it will be 18 fours are 72 220 degree and students uh, not 220 sorry 720 degree and 210 degrees plus on left side when we transfer it to other side it will become minus and left over will be 17 d degree is equal to 720 degree minus 210 degree and students when we subtracted 210 0 will be subtracted from 0 and 0 1 is subtracted from 2 and 1 and 2 is subtracted from 7 and remaining is 5 so it will be 510 degree and 17 is multiplying with d when we transfer it to other side it will divide and d degree will be 510 degree over 17 and d degree is equal to 17 ones are 17 and 17 threes are 51 and 17 zeros are 0 so d degree means 30 degree and degree will be cancelled with degree and the value of d is 30 so students it's uh, the value of d in D part of question number 2. And it's enough for today. May Allah Almighty bless you all the time. And have a good day.